that's my old Dollar Tree haul I wanted to share with you. You may find it uninteresting. I don't know, but I thought I would share it with you. Um, I had to go to Tombucto today to see a patient, so I thought while I was there, I would stop in their Dollar Tree in that area. So that's what I did. And I found these few things. Um, first of all, this is probably nothing that you're going to be interested in, but you never know. They have these little natural inhalers help nasal passages feel fresher. Natural blend of essential oils with refreshing vapor. Well, I bought two. I just dropped one, so here's the other one. Two of these because me and my husband, I think we have allergies or something. I don't know. So I thought I'd get us both one and we could try it. He said one day he was... He got up, he worked third, and he got up, and he was all stopped up, and so he went in there to find some Vicks to kind of put just a little bit right there, and he looked, and it was expired since 2009. I said, well, I guess I need to clean out my medicine cabinet. You would think, me being a nurse, that I would have that on check all the time, but no. Okay, second, I bought these scratch and sniff stickers. I thought they were very cute. And there are 20 of them. 20 scratch and sniff stickers. I thought they were cute. Next, I picked up some of these just because I'm out and I wanted some more. I use them for my swatches and just wipe my hands off on if I'm in my room in here. I got some of these. This is a better deal. This had 40 in it for a dollar and this has 25 in it. And I really don't know which one's the best. I just got one of each. Now I found these. I've not seen these before. So this is a first time haul that I've seen. I haven't seen anybody else do it. I found these little Yes to Carrots travel pack. Regular $3.99. They are nourishing shampoo and pampering conditioner. The shampoo and well and conditioner are for normal to dry hair. And like I said, that came from Target in the regular $3.99. I got them for a dollar. So I got to throw them in my travel pack case. Okay. These pens I had bought already before, and I absolutely love them, so I saw them and I thought I would get some more, but it's these. They're really good pens, y'all. They are fine point, and I just love them. I got two packs. So there you go. All right, and then I picked up a thermometer for myself. I have thermometer for my patients, but every time I need a thermometer, it's out in my car, so I thought I'm putting one of these in my house. And then I found this. I thought this would be pretty for Valentine's Day and spring. But it is the, what do you call it? Trans, I don't know what you call that. It's that, um, not transparent, not translucent. You know what I'm talking about, that word. The metallic looking, hot pink duct tape. Got that. And I found one washi. One washi tape in that whole store. They didn't even have two of them. They had one, and it was this. The last one they had, the only one they had, and I got it. Like I said, I can never find washi tape. I don't know what it is. It's not meant for me to have any. So, okay. Now, this stuff probably might not interest you, but we'll see. I picked up some of these Brillo Basic scrub foam, uh, sponges. They had a pack. It was a six pack of their brand for a dollar, but I just wanted to try the Brillo. I'll use one of these sponges for about a week and then I throw it out. And then I picked up some gallon garbage, uh, gallon freezer bags. These have 14 in them. And then 50 zipper sandwich bags. My husband takes his lunch, so. Oh, I picked up two of these sponges. And I picked up a box of these raisins that'll go on my oatmeal in the mornings. And I was looking, they had the bag with the little boxes, the, the little individual boxes, but it was only three ounces total for a dollar. So I got the big box and it's four and a half ounces for a dollar. So I got this little bin right here because I need a way to store my stickers and my stamps that I'm getting. So I went on and got this bin just to try it. I'll show you if I get it up and working. And I got this one. This one's longer. And I got 
these. I've eaten these before. These are pretty good. But what I like to do with these is I put them in my cookie jar. And <laughs> I have to take my medicine at night before I go to bed. So, you know, we eat supper early. And so I usually don't eat anything else after about 6 o'clock at night. So I have to have something. I can't just take a pill and go to bed. It gets stuck right there and it's disgusting. So I always like to have one or two crackers or one or two cookies or something to wash that. Knock it on down. So, and those are pretty good. If you've never tried them, they're pretty good. It's the Knott's Berry Farm. Strawberry shortcake. Strawberry shortbread cookie. Then I picked up these. Every time I see pirate stickers, I tend to get them because my son is at East Carolina and he's a pirate. So I'm just drawn to any pirate themed stuff. Now this one, I thought this was pretty. I have a organizer that's on my coffee, where I have my coffee set up, my Keurig. It's the um, Rubbermaid 3 drawer organizer for my K-cups and my sugars and my creams and my stir straws and all that good stuff. Anyway, I got these because I'm wanting to decorate that. So I thought that would be cute. These here, of course, because, you know, what I was just talking about. Some pirate stuff. I don't know what I'm ever going to do with these. I'm going to have to make a lot of pirate pocket letters. And then spring is coming, and I saw these and thought they were cute, the little caterpillars. So I got those, and the little owl, and the bee, ladybugs, snails. Anyway, so I think that's all of my Dollar Tree haul. I hope you enjoyed it. Give me a thumbs up or not. Comment, like, subscribe, share, whatever. And I will see you back here soon. Y'all have a blessed, blessed week. Bye.